you've heard the old saying, the best defense is a good offense. Well, in the animal kingdom, evolution has come up with some interesting ways for animals to protect themselves. So today on Zyology, we're going to look at crappy defenses. Now, by crappy, I don't mean bad. I'm being literal. The larva of the tortoise beetle is tiny, and being a newborn, it has a soft body that lacks a shell. So what's a baby tortoise beetle to do? Well, here's a little trick. It can build a shield out of poo. The larva builds a perfect backfitting shield out of its own feces, but then here's the best part. Because it's attached onto what's known as the anal fork, the shield can be maneuvered up and down to protect the larvae from predators like ants and aphid lions. Now, it's not the physical barrier that works here, it's the chemical defense. The feces contain chemicals from the leaves the larva eats, and ants that come across it immediately back away. Pygmy sperm whales have a different type of dramatic defense, making me wonder if I'd ever want to encounter one on a dive. When threatened, the whale releases an anal syrup, ejecting up to 12 liters of a dark brown fluid to create a big brown cloud behind them. Using its fin, the whale then stirs up the cloud for a quick getaway. And last but not least, there's the gorgeous hoopoe bird. The birds have a gland above their tails that produce a foul and pungent liquid. To ward away predators, the birds smear this horrible juice, which is said to smell like rotting meat, all over their feathers. And apparently this works very well. Their young have also adapted to projectile spray feces at nest predators from the age of six days, with streams reaching up to 50 centimeters or more. Lovely, lovely birds. So there you have it. Sometimes you don't need a solid defense because a liquid one works even better. Ew.